rival as Prime Minister has increased chatter amongst both people. This appears to be a, a leak from security services. What's your reaction to that? Uh, look, there has been ongoing attempts over the years, uh, uh, both to uh, reach Australia and also there have always been rumoured attempts of going beyond that. Um, that is not new, um, but my message will continue to be very clear. Uh, anyone who tries to uh, uh, put at risk vulnerable people's lives should come under the full force of the law. It is unacceptable uh, to have people manipulate those in vulnerable situations by acting as smugglers uh, and organising uh, shipments of people. They must be stopped. New Zealand has played a role in trying to stop them. But is this a pushback from the Australian government, a strategic leak to argue that you're a soft touch? I can't answer that. Are you, are you a soft touch? Oh, as I've just said, uh, we have been involved for a number of years uh, as a country working alongside Australia and trying to stop people at the source uh, from risking their lives and trying to make that journey. And we will continue to do so. New Zealand's policy in that regard has not changed, nor has the message uh, that the full force of the law will come down on anyone who tries to take advantage of vulnerable people uh, by risking their lives by having them board boats to Australia or New Zealand. My Minister, have you been uh, given any indication from Malcolm Turnbull that chatter has begun again among ex I've given. I've been given no indication that chatter ever stopped. Um, we know that this is an ongoing issue. Uh, it has been an issue for a number of years. Uh, of course, as I say, both countries have engaged uh, in working together to try and stop what has been a problem for a number of years. Have you, you talked to him yet? You, uh, not since I saw him passing, but uh, our officials have been talking together. So are you going to have that conversation?